Gabriel says it really is the best way to start. Sometimes reading scriptures and such, the mind can get caught up, seeming that this is some mysterious and aloof thing, yes. That's why I've been saying that I am the bearer of good news. <laughs> that this truth which you are looking for, it's the simplest. In fact, that which does not even seem looking, does not even need looking. What is already here without looking for it? What is just present without looking for it? If you say, I am just tired, I am not going to look for anything at all, I am done with this inquiry thing. No exploring, no finding, no looking, nothing. But even to, even for all of this, you have to be there. Can you get rid of this you? Get rid of yourself. See, this is the funny thing. We have been looking for that which we cannot be rid of. That is why Bo Chankara and Bhagwan Sri Ramana Maharishi said that true knowledge is just the dropping of false ignorance. It is not the finding of something new. Because you have always been the self. You have just considered yourself to be something else, something else, something limited. How many are getting the essence of what I'm saying with this? Because this is really important. To otherwise we can keep feeling like we have to come to some place of truth or something like that. Where the sages have said, actually, no, you are that already. It is only what you are considering yourself to be, which is false. And as you remain empty of these notions, you are the full and complete self with nothing missing. And that which tells you that there is something missing or somewhere to go, that is just a mistaken notion about who you are. Because it is not speaking about you as consciousness, about you as the self. It is speaking about you as a limited entity, which is never true. 